Today we play all mini games in Mario Party the Top 100 that are not in Mario Party Superstars. These two games have a lot of overlapping mini games, so today we play all the mini games that are unique to Mario Party the Top 100 with some fun facts also throughout the video, and I hope you enjoy this video. First up is Hexagon Heat, and this one might actually remind you of a mushroom mix-up from Mario Party Superstars, because it is actually very similar in a lot of ways. It's like the only difference is instead of running to mushrooms, we are running to colored hexagons and there's lava below us. Instead of a- oh, get me up there. Oh man, look at the way that I bounced off those guys. That was unreal. Uh-oh, 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 we've got to go. We've got to go, we've got to go. Luigi, 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 you got to stop, bro. There we go! All right, that was such an evil way to win that squishing Luigi there. All right, three-door Monty. This is an interesting one. So we have to keep track of these three characters over here. And we have to quickly select uh, which one they're in. Okay, so let's see. Goomba is B. Oh wait, never mind. Okay, so it is... Toad, Koopa, Goomba. Toad, Koopa, Goomba. Let's see. Uh, Goomba, so that's A. Everyone got it right, but I was the fastest over here getting it in 0.7 seconds. Very nice. So that means Mario is the winner! Congratulations, Mario, for winning Three Door Monty. All right, triple jump, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, this is a mashing one. This one is super interesting. For the first jump, you mash A. Then for the second jump, you mash B. Let's go and go! Ah, oh, didn't beat the record. That's so sad, so sad. Let's see if that's good enough to beat them. Luigi's known for his good jumps. So let's see how he does. This is super cool because it's like, it's not only mashing, but oh! Oh my goodness, he's right behind me. Not only is it mashing, but you mash different buttons and you have to switch. Wait, can't Peach float? Peach can normally float. Wait, will she float well? Ah, oh, Peach looks like you're floating from Super Mario 3D World didn't help you out much. Wait, Yoshi can also do a flutter kick. How good will his flutter kick here be? Will it help him out? Will it let him win? Let's see. Oh my goodness, he came in last. Wow, when Luigi was so close, I was actually a little scared. of like, are these guys going to beat me? But every CPU after Luigi just did worse and worse. Look how sad Yoshi looks there. That's so sad. Same with Princess Peach. All right, time for the beat goes on. This one over here is from Mario Party 3, okay? And we gotta use A, B, and Y to beat the drum. And we have to remember the order. Okay, wait, am I up first? Okay, it looks like I'm in first, okay. Y, A, or wait, is Yoshi up first? Okay, Yoshi's up first, okay. So he's gotta do Y, A, and then he can add his own. Okay, so so far it's Y, A, A, so it's yeah! Yeah! Okay, that's what it is. Y, A, A, B, Y. That's what it is now. And you get to add your own drum beat to the end. Okay, so that's Y, A, A, B, Y. Oh, she got it wrong. Peach is in last place now. Okay. Now let's see, Yoshi. Y, A, A, B, Y, A. Okay. So that's yeah, yeah. Y, A, A, B, Y, A. Oh, he got it wrong. Okay. Hold on, they've gotten it wrong so many times that I don't know if I can even remember now. Y, A, A, B, Y, A, A. I'm just gonna keep repeating the same pattern as long as I can. Just kind of funny. Y, A, A, B, Y, A. Oh, it's supposed to be A, A. Okay, so it looks like we came in first place over here. Goodbye, CPUs. I like this one because it's like a memory one, but it also consecutively gets harder as you go through the mini game. Three throw is a super fun one. This has got to be one of my favorite mini games in this game. It is such a cool one, okay? And it looks like it originally comes from Mario Party 4. All right, time your jump shots to make a basket. And the middle ones are worth two points. The top and bottom are worth one point each. Okay, so let's go. Yeah, we got a two, let's go. Okay, we got a one there, and nice, got a top one there. And if someone already has their balls somewhere, then you can't also uh, put your balls there. Like, look at that, these guys are just filling up the whole middle shelf. No, I missed the middle one. No, I missed it twice, oh no. Where can I even put my balls now? I would like to put my balls right there. I'd like to put my balls right there. I'm missing them all. My start was so good. But then this happened, and how many points do we have? Nine, we tied with Yoshi in first. Okay, I wanna redo this, and I want Mario to be the sole winner. And it's a big advantage when you are uh, near the middle, actually. Actually, I don't know about that. Maybe uh, being near the edge is actually better, but let's see. Ah, uh, too bad we didn't get the, oh boy. Uh, let's go like that, nice. 
Let's go like that. Okay, getting all the top shelf ones. But the middle is worth the most. Okay, let's go. Oh, come back. Come back to me, baby. Let's go. Come back here. And no. There we go. Nice. Uh, stop filling up all the twos. Come back here. Come back here, you. Let's go. There's another two. And we won. We won. We beat Yoshi by two. Very nice. Okay, so here is Mario Speedwagons. This is one that wasn't in Mario Party Superstars. And what we want to do here is we want to accelerate and shift gears. Let's go. Okay, nice, 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 nice start. Now then let's get up to there. And go up to there. And hopefully that's all right. Let's see. How's that? First, very nice. We won by 0.17 seconds. Peach was so close there. Oh, and we got a new record. That's pretty cool. All right, Hotel Goomba is an absolutely fantastic one. This is a super cool kind of puzzle-like mini game. It's very similar to uh, when you're playing Pokemon games and you use the strength ability where it's like you can push the boulders by walking into them, but over here we can push the Goombas by punching them. You know, let's see, let's just go like this, then like that. Okay, that was a very, very simple one. Luigi was walking back and forth, he's like, eh, Mario, what do I do here? Oh wait, what do I do here now? Let's go like this, like this, like this, and push that one out of the way, very nice. And is that it? Yeah, we are the winner, that's very nice. Oh my goodness, I thought Luigi would be second, but Peach actually in second, Luigi very close behind, and sad Yoshi in last place again, so sad. All right, time for Cage in cooking. Bowser has us all trapped, and we have to press the correct buttons to escape. Let's go. X, R, A, Y, X, B, L, Y. Yes, okay, nice. Not only did we escape, but we escaped first. Everyone got away, so Bowser doesn't burn anybody this time. And luckily for us, Mario is in first place, and we don't have sad Yoshi anymore. Now we have sad Luigi, so sad. All right, time for Strawberry Short Fuse. This is a difficult one. You have to remember the cakes and not the bombs, but it's so hard to keep track of many of these. Like, it's easy to keep track of, like, one monkey, maybe two monkeys. Oh, boy. Okay, I think the one on the very bottom right has a cake, but other than that, I have no idea. Hopefully these guys get a lot of bombs. Yep, goodbye, Princess Peach. Very nice. Hey, Yoshi, don't pick the bottom right one. Don't. Don't. Okay, good. Please be a bomb. It's a bomb! Okay, amazing! Okay, okay, it looks like the CPUs have been pretty unlucky. I'm picking this one. This one should have a cake. Yes, very nice. Now, Luigi, if you just pick a bomb right away, I'll be so happy. Let's see. Let's see. And... Oh my goodness! We had a perfect game! Everybody just pick the bombs right away. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. That is fantastic. Wow, that was a nice pass win. I thought I'd have to play this mini game a few times, but there we go. First try win. Dizzy rotisserie. Okay, so we're spinning around in these cages. We're a bit dizzy right now. You use the joystick to attempt to move in a given direction. And what we want to do is make it up there. And your uh, directions every few moments uh, it randomly changes, so it's not like you always hold the same way Because it keeps changing and there we go. There we go. Okay. We made it. We made it. We were first very nice Yeah, so it's not like your controls are reversed It's like your controls are almost reversed and it keeps changing like if you keep holding up You won't always go the same direction like you'll start to like walk in a circle Track and yield instead of track and field. And what we want to do is jump over these hurdles. And wait, are there also electric things in this mini game? Are some of them also electrified? I can't remember if there are some that are also electrified. I think for some reason there might be some that are also electrified. There we go. Oh boy. Gotta be careful. Let's be careful here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yoshi's almost. Oh boy. Yes! Okay, very nice win over there. Those guys just both got caught. That's fantastic. And this is such a cool mini game. It's from Mario Party 7. I've got to get and play Mario Party 7. Because there's some really cool looking mini games from that one. Oh boy, deckhands. This is one that is pure luck. You know what? I was just talking about how I should play some Mario Party 7, but right now, I don't know. This one is actually pure luck. It's everyone chooses three cards, and what you want is the highest total. It's like... There's no way to know which card is the highest. Yeah, like, look at that. We got a two over here. That's so sad. And the numbers, I think they go up to, like, 15 or so. Yeah, there's a six from Peach. Okay, go ahead, Luigi. Get something small. Get a one. That's not small. 
Okay, so I have the smallest, so I get to go first now. Let's pick this one right here. Give me a humongous number. Oh my goodness, a one! A what? We have- if we get a three next, then we actually have the smallest possible score. And the goal is to get the largest possible score. Okay, so let's see. Okay, Yoshi gets a four. Okay, if I get- oh wait, no, 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 Luigi still has to go. Don't get a three. Don't get a three. He got an 11. If I get a three right now, then I have actually the lowest possible score and literally the worst possible luck in this minigame. There's a one in five chance that that happens. Let's choose this one. Are you serious? We actually got the worst possible luck in this game. And of course, we come in last place because that's the lowest possible score that you can get. All right, time for Balloon Busters. This is a crazy one. Okay, and you actually have to, uh, Speak into the microphone for this one. Well, you have to make noise into the microphone and you don't want the balloon to pop. You want to blow as much as you can into that, but you don't want it to pop. You want it to pop for the other people. And you have to blow at least once, which is a bit scary because right now it looks like it's about to explode. I don't know if I even want to blow at all into that because it looks like it's about to pop. Okay, let's go. Blow! Okay, I have to be very, very quiet because, like, if you make a noise, then, uh, then you keep blowing. Okay, because I is scared. Oh, wow, it looks like, uh, we could have done a bit more, actually. Oh, boy. Ah, goodbye, Luigi. Goodbye, Luigi. All right, Yoshi's up next. If you don't blow at all, then it automatically does, uh, five blows when the timer runs out. So you want to be careful. Okay, so let's go. Blow. Blow. One more. Thank goodness that didn't explode, oh man. Oh man, I was so scared. Okay, let's see, Peach. Oh, goodbye, Peach. Just two blows and it was gone. Okay, now it's down to Yoshi and I. So I've got to play this super, 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 super carefully. Blow. Blow. Okay, 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 it didn't explode. All right, Yoshi, please, just do a lot, do a lot here, Yoshi. Keep going, yes, yes, okay, okay, that's great, all right. What a nice victory we have here. All right, here is Dart Attack, another one from Mario Party 7, and this is a fantastic one, okay. You have to be careful, because when we talk, we blow. Start. Blow. 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 Not bad at all. There we go. Okay, I was really focused on that. Okay, 170 points. Pretty good. Okay, man, you gotta be careful because it's like even if you get a nice shot and then you go, nice, then that could activate the microphone and then that will make Mario blow another dart. Oh, man. But yeah, this is such a cool one. This is one from uh, Mario Party 7. I've definitely got to play some uh, Mario Party 7. I've got to get and play that game. I think that could be quite nice. Okay. Peach and Luigi both have a hundred points. What about Yoshi? How are you gonna do? Man, and look at these Goombas and Koopas in the background just hopping up and down. Wow, Yoshi's doing great. Oh my goodness, 110. Oh! Oh my goodness, I thought that he would get the 50. Oh wait, but even if he did get the 50 the turn before, that just would have brought him up to 160, I think. But we still do win that one. But yeah, Yoshi definitely could have come back and won that. All right, crank to rank. So we want to bring up our flags, and the way that we do that is we want to, uh, rotate this quickly. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. So close, so close, so close. Did we win? Did we win? Yes, we won, and a new record. Very nice. Oh, poor Princess Peach in last place. It's her castle. Maybe she gets someone else to raise the flag. That would make sense. All right, at the chomp wash. This is a fantastic one. So we use the stylus again in this one, and we want to, uh, scrub off the paint as quickly as we can. Very nice. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Very nice. Ready for this one? Very nice. What's next? Give me the next one, give me the next one, let's go. Very nice. Where's the next one? Right here, right here, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go, are we done? Yeah, look how happy our chain jump is. That's fantastic. All right, that was some fast scrubbing we did over there. Okay, aim of the game instead of name of the game. This is quite the interesting one. Okay, so we move the joystick and we want to hit five cards and get the highest score possible. Okay, we need a 50 to start. A 50 would be perfect. Wait, 
What is that, 50? No, that was 20. Okay, we got a 50, we got a 50. Now we just need all the X2s. Let's go, where are the X2s at? Right there. A lot of X0s, gotta be careful. Uh-oh. Okay, nice, an X2. Give me that X2. Nice. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, and we have five. Okay, did we get 50 and then all X2s? Let's see. And... There we go. I think that might be the highest possible score, starting with a 50 and getting all X2s. That's very nice that we were able to get that. Okay, loggerheads is a super fun one. This one's from Mario Party 9. Okay, so we want to swing at the logs or take cover if it's a bomb and you want to be fast. Let's see. Go. Yeah, we got it. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, what's next? Oh, take cover. Nice. What's next? It's not going to be two bow bombs in a row, is it? Oh, it is two bomb in a row. Peach got hit. Not gonna be three in a row, is it? Let's see. No! I swung at it! No, 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 no. Now I'm out for a round, okay? So one of them gets get oh Peach. Peach got uh Peach got back there. Get it! Yeah, okay, okay. I just need one more. Okay, let's play risky. I'm going for it no matter what it is. Oh no! It was a bomb bomb! I shouldn't have gone for it. I'm like, I'm just gonna go for it just to win. Okay, now Luigi or Peach gets a shot over here. Peach gets a second one. Now, I actually have to be careful. We don't want Peach to win, do we? Do we? Let's go. Yeah, there we go. We won. That was a close game, but we won it. It was a great game. All right, time for bumper bubbles. And this one's interesting because you actually tilt your system back and forth to go left and right. And you hold A to move up and down. Okay, and you want to collect a... Oh my goodness, I've already popped right at the start like that. Okay. Okay, but we get to come back. Okay, let's see. Can we, uh... Ah, oh, man, these CPUs are so good at playing defensively. They're so good at avoiding the spiked balls. Okay, let's see. Give me that one. Oh, did I get that one or did Peach? Okay, get that one. What if I just focus on collecting balloons instead of going for the others? What if I just play, uh... What if I just try and get up my score? I'll play as if this is... I'll play as if, uh, the CPUs aren't against me. Everyone's just trying to play friendly over here. Yoshi, stay away, stay away, Yoshi. I'm keeping you up here because... Oh, wait, he only has two balloons. There's no need to worry about him. Uh, let me through. Please, 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 please. Please get out of here. Please let me through. Please let me through. Thank you. Yoshi, uh, I mean Luigi, yes. Yes, and Peach got hit right at the end like that, so I get to get some balloons here. And I think this means we win. Yes, we do! Alright, that's great. Alright, here's the minigame, don't look. So whatever way the arrow points, you want to look in a different direction. And sometimes you have multiple arrows and it gets more difficult as the minigame goes along. Start! So let's see, it's kind of similar to look away, except instead of looking away from a character, you want to look away from the arrows. Okay, so it's down, so let's look up. Okay, everyone got it, everyone got it. What's next? Let's see. Down, so we look up. Very nice. Is Luigi copying us? Where are we just doing the opposite of what the arrows show? Ah, uh, down. Nice. Wait, did Peach even do anything? How did she get a point? Maybe she looked at like the very last possible second. Ah, uh, yo, she missed. Yo, she missed. Okay, what's next? Up. Ah, uh, Luigi, you look down, Peach also. Okay, I'm one ahead of everybody. Hopefully we can maintain this lead. Let's see. Uh, oh no! Oh no, I looked to the right. Okay. Yeah. Everyone's already all caught back up. This is getting very scary. Uh, right. Very nice on the last second I got it. I almost looked down, actually. Let's see. Uh, down. Yeah! There we go. We're ahead. We are ahead. Two rounds to go. Uh, left. Ah, you guys get wrecked. What's next? Uh, left. Yeah, we got it. All right, all right. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Okay, does that mean we got one mistake? I thought that we would have had more than one mistake, but maybe we had only one mistake because that was nine points. Okay, peak precision in Mario Party 9 has to be one of my favorite mini games here. Okay, so let's see. How can we do? I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go. Two, one. Go! Let's go! Okay, that ending was a little confusing. Okay, but that's alright, that's alright. Under 8 seconds, so that's pretty nice. Wow, Yoshi with 11.63. Wait, was there even any D-pad that time? Because sometimes the D-pad is also something that you have to press. But hey, we got first place over here. Very nice. 
Okay, Magma Mayhem from Mario Party Night. This is an absolutely chaotic one. And, uh, I remember this one from my, uh, video where I tried to make everyone win in Mario Party 9 Step It Up. Oh, oh, it's down to the two brothers. And it's so chaotic when you're controlling all four characters at once. Okay, let's see. Should we just, uh, stay near the center? Should we just, uh, call it a truce, bro? Call it a truce, bro? Bro, unless you give me an opportunity. If you give me a good opportunity, I gotta get you, bro. I'm sorry. That's just how it is. Let's see, bro. Let's see, bro. Oh, man! He got me, he got me, he got me. Okay, Luigi played well, but let's see if we can get our revenge this time. We could come in first, that'd be amazing. Man, a jump kick does so much damage. A jump kick is like the best way to go, I think. Okay, goodbye. Oh no, oh no, don't jump on him. Let's see, let's see, where you at bro, where you at bro? Where you at bro? Yeah, there we go, that's how you do it, okay. When you can do like a nice kick dive towards someone like that, that's a great way to get them out. All right, Mario comes back here, very nice. All right, this one is actually one of the hardest mini games in this game. Because not only do you steer by tilting your system left and right, but the controls are actually very, very difficult. And if you bump into anything, you lose a ridiculous amount of speed. Like when you bump into a wall, your speed, yeah, like this, your speed goes down to basically nothing. It's a very, very unforgiving mini game. Okay, let's just make our way over here. Get the boost, nice, okay, and then lose all your speed, nice, good job. I don't think we're winning this one. Let's go, yeah, even with that little speed boost there, just drag along the wall doing nothing. Great job, Mario. And maybe a boost, but yeah, it's like, just drive into the wall. Yeah, people are already done the race. It's up to, it's down to Luigi and I, who's gonna win? No, Luigi wins, I'm in fourth place, right? Yeah, fourth place here. This is one mini game that if I want to get good at this, it is going to need a ridiculous amount of work. Okay, time for Jigsaw Jumble. This is quite the difficult one, especially to do quickly. Okay, so let's see, what do we need next? We need a piece like that. What even goes like that? That goes like that. Okay, this one, uh, how's that? Very nice. Three out of five, very nice. Okay, this one, how's that? Nope, 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 nope. There we go, very nice. Okay, one more to go, one more to go. Okay, now bomb 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 bomb. What even faces that way? Nothing. I don't have this piece. Oh my goodness! We got it! We got it! We got it! We got it! All right, that's great. I'm like, where even is that piece? We don't have this piece. Like, obviously you do have the piece, but I'm looking at all the pieces. I'm like, where is it? I don't have anything even shaped like that. Okay, next up is Peer Pressure from Mario Party 9. It's funny because the minigame sounds like Peer Pressure, it's a pun on that. And I actually had to take a break from filming this video for a couple of days because I had to work on some other videos first. Okay, so this is, I'm pretty sure, a pure luck minigame where you want to select a fishing rod over here and hopefully you're just not eliminated like Peach just was right there. Okay, so Yoshi's up next. So Peach is in fourth because she's out right away. What about Yoshi? Okay, Yoshi got a cheap cheap. That means he gets to stay. So I probably have a roughly 50-50 chance. I don't know how many urchins there are. Let's choose this one right here. Hopefully it's a cheap cheap. And it's a cheap cheap. Okay, so we survive. All right, Luigi, you're up. What are you going to choose? Luigi chooses this one here. And is he eliminated? No, he also chose a cheap cheap. Okay, it's getting intense now because the number of... The cheap cheap to urchin ratio is going down. And there we go, yo, she is eliminated. Oh boy, oh boy. Now let's see, let's see, which one do I choose? Let's go with this one over here. Urchin or cheap cheap? Cheap cheap, okay, we survived, we survived. Let's see. Luigi, which do you choose? Sometimes it comes down to like the final two fishing rods and then you're forced to take one. Oh my goodness, okay. So I'm pretty sure only one of these We'll have an urchin, so hopefully we don't pick that one. Or wait, yeah, there should be only one, right? One or two? Oh, no, but we are out either way. Yeah, only one would have had the urchin. All right, Goomba Bowling. This one is a classic from Mario Party 9. This is a fantastic one. Let's see what the order is. Okay, Yoshi's up first. That means I'm up next. Okay, let's go. So what you want to do is hit as many Goombas as possible. 
with your Koopa shell that you throw. That! Oh my goodness! I've never seen anyone do that well. Never, never, never have I seen anyone do that well. That's incredible. That was done very, very well. Okay, let's go like this. And now, go. Yes. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I got perfect, I got perfect, I got perfect. I didn't even know that was possible. Oh my goodness, the highest I've ever gotten was like nine or 10 or 11. And somehow I just suddenly went from that to a perfect game. That's unbelievable. Oh my goodness. Wow. I'm so impressed. Today is going to be a very good day. Not only am I going to have good luck, but everyone watching this is going to have good luck now. Just because of how well that went. That was phenomenal. I can't believe that. Wow. I didn't okay. think that we would win this one. After seeing Yoshi go like that, I thought, well, I guess this is one that the CPUs are winning. But then that happened. I can't believe that. This has now become one of my favorite mini games just because of that. Sword to Score is a fantastic one. This one is from Mario Party 10. And Mario Party 10 is such an underrated Mario Party game. Okay, it looks like we are up first over here. Okay, so let's see. When do we want to go? Let's watch. And let's be ready. We want to get as many points as possible. Let's go. Like, duh, duh, duh. Alright, not bad. Not 100, but 80 is a pretty good start, I think. And you know what? It's so funny when you play this game against the easier CPUs. I think the easier CPUs can actually get zero. Like, they land on the other half that you can't even see. Like, it looks like the lowest points that you can get is 20 by landing on the blue ones on the left and right. But if you land on the green part at the very bottom, you can actually get zero. Wow, Peach was so close to the 60 there. All right, Yoshi, you're up. Are you gonna do better than these CPUs? I'm surprised they're not doing better, because this is... Yeah, there we go. Okay, Yoshi's making up for the other CPUs who aren't playing great. Final round. If we could get 100, that'd be amazing. Let's see. Ah, 80. Okay, another 80. That's all right. The only person who can beat us right now is Yoshi, if he gets 100. So how's Luigi gonna do? Are you gonna do a bit better this round? 60, okay, a bit better. Look at him waving. His head looks so funny. All right, Peach, you go ahead. You must get dizzy if you spit on something like that. Oh my goodness, this reminds me of amusement parks. Amusement parks is... That's something that I haven't thought about in so long. I kind of forgot that those existed. Oh my goodness, I haven't been to them since like I was a kid. Okay, what about Yoshi? If he gets 80, he ties me. 100, he wins. Less than 80, I win. Okay, he gets 60 this time. So Yoshi is in second place. Luigi and Peach tied in last place. And Mario wins this one. Man, I'm just so hyped about how that Goomba bowling went. That was incredible. Okay, blame it on the crane. This one is from Mario Party 4, apparently. I haven't played Mario Party 4 yet. But, let's see, yeah, we got Yoshi right away. This one actually reminds me so much of a mini game from uh, Super Mario Party. Oh my goodness, I'm doing great. Okay, and there we go, we got Luigi. Now it's just Peach. We just have to get Peach. Let's see, where's she going? Over there. So, oh no, that's too early. Okay, at least we didn't get one of the Koopa Troopas. Because the Koopa Troopas, they could kind of block Peach and uh, get in her way. So let's see, when do we want to go? How about now? Ah, oh, too late that time. Okay, last time we were too early. This time we were too late. Still got 20-something seconds to get her, so we've got a few more attempts. Hopefully. Hopefully. And come on, Peach! No! No, Peach! Peach is doing very well, man. The first two were so easy, but this last one is being quite tricky. And there we go! We got her! We got her! Alright! Look at her struggling when she gets caught like that. That's so sad. Oh man, and only seven seconds were left, but we did win that one. Okay, since Peach was so good last time, let's see if we can beat her when we are all against her. Okay, so far she got nobody. Let's run over there, run over there. Okay, good, 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 good. It's nice that you could also run- Oh, no, 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 I don't want to stay together with Yoshi, actually. Because then it's like- Yes! Okay, good, she missed both of us. Okay, Yoshi, let's spread out a bit. There we go. I wanna run, I wanna run, I wanna run. Get by, get by, get by. Nice, 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 nice. It's nice that you could run along with this. Okay, and I wanna go, I wanna go, I wanna go. Perfect, okay. It's like, when you're in this part, you want to run against where this is rotating so that you don't get caught. But, when she starts going down, that's when you're like, no, 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 let me run quickly so I can get past so she doesn't have a chance to get me before it comes down again. Okay, let's see. 
He got nobody. Uh, can I get away? Can I get away? Can I get away? Yes! Okay, that's actually an amazing strategy. That's such a good strategy. Let's see. Oh, I was wondering, I'm like, is anybody going to get caught? Just Yoshi got caught. Look at the Koopa Troopas and everyone's still running and Mario's just standing in the bubble. All right, hide and go boom. This is a pure luck-based minigame. I remember my first time ever playing this minigame. I'm like, they're all going to be in this cannon. And I just picked a cannon and I got all them out together. So hold on, how many attempts do you have? I don't remember if you, oh, I guess you have three attempts because it looks like there are three shy guys here. Okay, so we want to fire everybody out of the cannons and they can go into whatever cannon they want. So let's choose A right now. Let's see, anybody in A? Anybody? Okay, goodbye, Luigi. Of course it would be Luigi. All right, the next shy guy. Oh, oh, I thought that they would get to split up again, but they don't, okay? So let's do Y. Anybody in Y? Anybody? Nobody! Oh, no! So the only way that I could win now is if they are both in the same cannon and the cannon that I pick. If there's only one person here, then they win. Let's see. There's nobody there! Ah, oh, if I picked B, I would have won. That's so sad. Yoshi and Peach both went into B. To be or not to be? That is the question. All right, Mario Party 5 minigame here. Okay, so you can do B for a fake swing and A for a real swing. And I remember my first time playing this minigame. I wasn't sure exactly how it works. I just ended up getting everyone out together. Oh, you can actually come back like that. That's pretty crazy. Okay, unless it's like that. Let's... Oh, no. There we go. We got him. Okay, I was very focused there. All right, that's pretty cool. Okay, Luigi did very well surviving here. So let's see if we can survive against him. Oh, you can also ground pound. Oh! Oh! This is so scary. Oh, my goodness. It's like every time he just goes for me. Oh, I'm still back somehow. He's not faking it at all. Oh, yes! Yes, I thought that we would get out. It's like you see those discs flying across and you're like, I'm out, I'm out. But you still actually have the chance to jump and move to the left. Oh my goodness. All right, Crate in Peril is a really interesting one. Wait, which, uh, which Mario Party game is this one from? Okay, well, what you want to do is tilt the system to shake the box and you want to hit your rivals with the spiny shells. So let's see. Okay, there's Peach. Let's see. Come on, guys. There we go, just one more to go. Where are you going, Luigi? Where are you going, bro? Oh, no. Luigi, how are you gonna do? How are you gonna do, Luigi? Come on, come here, Luigi. Come here, Luigi. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, oh boy, look at him just running in circles there. But, come on, come on. Yeah, there we go. All right, that was great. With eight seconds left, we got him. Oh, so this one is apparently from Mario Party 6. I'm actually kind of surprised. I wonder how this would work on Mario Party 6 since this is on the GameCube. Okay, let's try our best. Okay, let's try our best to dodge over here. Let's see, where are the spikes? Spikies, no! Luigi won in a second! In one second, he defeated us all! Next up is Desert Dash, and this is a really interesting one because Dungeon Dash is from Mario Party 2 and it is in Mario Party Superstars, but this one, Desert Dash, Oh, oh, let's start, let's start, okay. This one is in Mario Party 1 and Mario Party the Top 100. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's close, it's close, it's close. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Just gotta really focus here. And it looks like hopefully we win. Yes, okay, that was very close, but we did win this one. Okay, and this one is very similar to Dungeon Dash in Mario Party Superstars, but this is Desert Dash. So this one actually isn't in Mario Party Superstars. Looney Lumberjacks is from Mario Party 2. And this was a game that I would have loved to have seen in Mario Party Superstars. This is a super cool mini game. You have to work together with your teammate to saw through this as quickly as possible. And I remember whenever I'd play this as with friends, when we were both on the same team, I would take both controllers in my hand and I would press the buttons at the exact same time to make sure that we are playing this well. The Great Deflate Mario Party 4. This is a fantastic one. What you want to do is jump up and ground pound. Okay, let's go. There we go. Jump. Very nice. Jump. Oh no, I missed the ground pound. Oh no, that's so bad. That's so bad that I actually missed one like that. That's not good. Will we still be able to win even though we missed one? Come on. Come on. 
Come on! Yes! We just beat them! Oh my goodness, that was so close. I've never seen that minigame be so close before. That's a super cool one. I want to play Mario Party 4. I've actually never played Mario Party 4 before. All right, time for order up. This one is from Mario Party 4. Have I seen this one from a different Mario Party game before? I'm not sure if I have. Okay. So what we want to do is memorize these. Okay. Ice cream, fries, burger, burger, pogo soup. Ice cream, fries, burger, burger, pogo soup. Ice cream, fries, burger, burger, pogo soup. Okay, let's see. Ice cream, fries are there. No, no, no. This one is fries. Peach move. There we go. And they got it first. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, let's see. Okay. Fries, burger, soup, burgers, ice cream. Fries, burger, soup, burgers, ice cream. Let's remember that. Okay, fries, burgers, fries, burger, soup, burger. Oh, ice cream would have been just beside that. Yeah, to the right of that. Okay, Peach did that much faster than me. Okay, let's see. Okay, burgers, ice cream, drink, fries, pogo. Burgers, ice cream, drink, fries, pogo. Burgers, ice cream. Okay, nice. Peach got drink before me. That one also would have been drink. Okay, very nice. We need one more to win. Okay, let's see. Uh, burger, ice cream, fries, drink. Burger, ice cream, fries, drink. Okay, let's see. Burger, ice cream, fries, drink. Let's see. Burger, ice cream. Nice! Okay, it would have been burger, ice cream, fries, drink. But Peach got that one, so we've won. Wow. Even though the opposite team, they got the first point, we ended up winning overall. That's fantastic. Diffuse or lose from Mario Party 5. This is a fantastic minigame. It is super cool the way that this works. Okay, so the ball explodes. What we want to do is ground pound on these to stop these sparks from basically uh, reaching us. And you can also accidentally, you can accidentally, go Luigi. Oh no. You can accidentally flatten your partners like this. And that could be bad if that happens. Okay, Luigi, stay there, stay there. Luigi, I'll stay here. Very good, very good. Stay there, Luigi, stay there. Okay, I'll go like this. Good job. Good job, great teamwork. Okay, I'll get this one. You get that one. I'll get this one. Very good. Now I'll get this one. Where are you going, Luigi? Luigi, my bro. Luigi, bro, Luigi, bro. Okay, let's see. How are they going? Okay, theirs are getting kind of close. If any of these reach the ball bomb, oh no, then you lose. Okay, so that one's getting kind of close. We've got to be careful. We've got to be careful here. Uh oh. Uh oh, I squished him. Okay, but we won. We won because the one on the far right over there reached the bomb bomb, so we won. That's fantastic. You really have to work together in this mini game. Okay, Manic Mallets from Mario Party 5. This one is kind of like Poke Pubble, where you want to mash the A button, but it's actually a 2v2 mini game. And hold on, I think you actually don't want to go too fast because look, if you go too fast, then a bunch of your inputs actually get eaten. If you slow down a bit, yeah, if you slow down a little bit, then you actually mash much faster. That's crazy. When I was mashing super fast, a bunch of my inputs didn't count. Let me see what happens if we mash a bit slower. Okay, this time I'll try mashing a little slower. Yeah, and now none of my inputs are being eaten, even though this time I'm mashing much slower. I'm using only one hand to mash this time, instead of using two hands, and what do we get? 136! I was mashing so much slower, I was using only one hand, but our score is so much higher. That's really weird how that happens in some games. Like, if you mash too fast, some of your button inputs can get eaten like that. Alright, here we are. Slot trot. Okay, A is rotate up, B is rotate down. Okay, so in this one, we want to mash them together. Wait, wait, wait. So how do we do this? What do we want? Okay, we want a uh, Koopa Troop. Oh, oh, and you have to mash the button. Okay, let's go. Come on. There we go. Okay, okay. We got the first one. Very nice. Okay, what's next? What do we want? We want a mushroom. Okay, where's the mushroom? Right there. There we go. All right, we got the next one. This is a super cool one. Okay, and what's next? We want the Koopa Troopa, and that is right there. Come on, Peach. And yeah, we barely got that before them. It almost looked like they had it in frame, but... We win that three to nothing. Mario and Peach are a fantastic team here. Time for Sphere Factor from Mario Party 7. And it's so funny that it's making a reference to Fear Factor. Let's go, Team Mario and Luigi with the red ball over here. Let's go, let's go, bro. Let's go, bring it up here. All right, now we wanna go over to the right. Let's go over, let's go over. Bring it over fast this way. Okay, now push up. Very nice, now let's start going to the left. Bro, why are you just standing there, Luigi? Come on, Luigi, bro, let's go, bro. Let's go, bro. Okay, now let's start going up this way. Start going up this way. Come on, bro, let's go, let's go. We gotta work together. We gotta work together. What is that? What is that? Get out of here, Monty Mole. Okay, you know what? Forget the Monty Moles. We're going, we're going down here. We're going down here. Let's see. Wait, where even is Princess Peach? Where is Princess Peach? What happened to Princess Peach? 
I looked over for a second and Peach was just gone. What happened to her? I have to see the replay of that. What happened to her? Peach just disappeared. Okay, let's watch this back. Let's see what happens to Peach. Okay, she's walking on the bridge. Oh my goodness, she just got like stuck on the bridge. Then the game froze for a second. And then where did Peach go after that? We don't see Princess Peach anymore. What happened to her? All uh, right, here is a dual mini game. So this is a one versus one. It's me versus Luigi right now. And what we want to do is actually tilt the 3DS system. And you want to get the Koopa shells into these holes. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Just get in there. Get in there. There we go. Okay, we're a little slow. This is all right. This is all right. Let's just be careful here. Let's just be careful. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. Let's get this one in there. Very nice. All right. Very nice. Okay, we got two. One more to go. Just one more to go. Let's go. Okay, that's great. That's great. Now then just one more Koopa shell and we win. Come on. And there we go. That was the easiest one to get in at the end. All I have to do is tilt it down to the center. So we win that duel. Very nice. All right. Shy Guy Showdown from Mario Party 9. So this shy guy is gonna lift up a sign. It might be blank, in which case we press nothing. Or we might have to press A, B, X, or Y. X! Yeah! Okay, that's actually kind of surprising. Almost, I think, every single time I've ever played this mini game, the shy guy first raises a blank flag just to trick you. But this time, the sign actually had a button on it right away. Okay, button mashers. This is similar to the last one. Well, I guess the background is similar, but what you have to do is different. What you have to do is mash whatever button shows up. Okay, so right now we have to mash X. And whoever doesn't mash fast enough as more blocks fall down. Okay, X and Y together, that's fine. What's next? And A, okay. So we got three buttons we're mashing over here. What's next? L. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Pretty easy so far. What's next? Don't be R. Oh boy, it's R. How are we doing? How are we doing? And B. Now it's literally mash every single button. Okay, but there we go. We defeated Luigi. That was pretty tough. We had to mash like every single button of the controller there. My goodness. Fun fact, the minigame Tread Carefully is in Mario Party Superstars, but it has a different name in Mario Party 2 and Mario Party The Top 100, where it's called Shell Shock. Alright, time for Jewel Drop. This one is from Mario Party 10, and I have played this one in Mario Party 10 before. Okay, wait, how does it work? Okay, so you press A to, uh, rotate these, and if you get enough of the same color jewels together, then, uh, they get cleared, and you get points for that. Okay, wait, if we get the yellow one down there. Okay, nice. Let's keep the greens together there. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, that's a big yellow one. Okay, the greens are going there. That's good. Okay, those are all getting crushed together. Let's go like this. Try and get some of those over there. Maybe some of these over here. Why not get some greens in there? Get some yellows over here. Get some yellows over there. Very nice. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, do we want to shake the system soon? We might want to shake the system soon. If you hold L and R and you shake the system, then, uh, that makes... Oh, boy, oh, boy. What's going on? What's going on? Okay, so much is happening. So much is happening. So much is happening. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's put the green ones over there. Very nice. Yeah, because there's some bigger ones too. The bigger ones, like when you get a bunch of colors to match together, then that makes it so that uh, they shrink down in size. Oh no, but I, that's so sad that that one doesn't reach there. Okay, wait, where are these blues going? Get that over there. Get that over there. Maybe get that one over there. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I gotta. Might have to shake soon. Okay, let's shake. I, I have LNR pressed. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm shaking, I'm shaking, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. Am I using up all my stars? Okay, I used up one of my stars. I think you use up a star to shake. And when you shake up, it does destroy. I don't know if it necessarily destroys stuff or if it just shakes stuff up. Shakes up stuff so that it starts to get together. Okay, but wait, wait, wait. Oh, I was hoping to get that one down there. Let's see. Uh, big blue one over here. Let's go like that. Okay, nice. And some blue ones here. Maybe that'll shrink down now. But let's see. How are we going? Okay, we got two stars. Do I want to shake yet? Okay, I probably want to shake now because there's a yellow one there. Shake, 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 shake. Come on, keep going. Okay, I guess that's all I could shake. That wasn't a very useful shake. Okay, and uh, Luigi's doing pretty great, but he has no stars right now. Okay, so let's go here. Get the green one there. That'll be nice. Get uh, get some yellow there. Why not get some yellow over here and some pink? Oh boy. Uh, if I could get some yellow down there. Oh no. Oh, we won! Okay, nice! And I still had three stars left, so that's quite nice. Hooray! Okay, let's do Badminton Bash. 
This one is also from Mario Party 10. And let's see if we can beat these guys. Who's starting? Oh, I'm starting, nice. Okay, so you can do B for a normal hit or A for a power hit. Oh, man, Peach don't for but she missed. All right, let's go. Wait, yeah, we get a point. Okay, now I serve that way. Okay, let's go. Go, Yoshi. No, Yoshi! I counted on you, Yoshi. All right, let's see. I'll do a power hit. I'll do a normal hit. Now power hit that way. Whoa, that was a fast power hit back. Yoshi, no! Oh man, I should have been at the back there to get that. Okay, let's see, where are you going, Peach? Over there? I think you have to, wow! Luigi missed that. I think when you first serve, I think you have to serve it diagonally. Let's go. Oh no, that's out. Ah, oh, she just lets it fall out. That's not good. This is not good. Let's see, whoop. I don't know if that would have been out. Go again, Yoshi, Yoshi, no, you could have swung again, Yoshi, no. Yoshi, please, please, you have to win for us, Yoshi. Oh, that's out, that's out. Yeah, there we go. Not going for it when it's out is a good strategy. Let's go like that. Come on. Did Yoshi, no, we both just stood there. I think Yoshi literally did not move for that entire round. Okay, nice, nice, okay, at least we got that. Is it my server, Yoshi's? Yoshi, please win for us. Let's go. Nice. Oh, no. Oh, no, that was my fault. Okay, match point. If they score, they win. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, they still have match point. Wait. Okay, six, six. I don't think it's win by two. I think it's just whoever scores wins. Yeah, okay, so it all comes down to this. Wish me good luck, everybody. Let's go. Nice. Oh boy! Oh boy! Go! Ah, yes! Yes! Okay, they got it out. That means that we win. Oh my goodness! What an intense match! That was certainly a close match. Time for the Jumpman duel. This is from Mario Party 7, and this is a duel against Donkey Kong over here. Let's go. This was actually a super fun one from the. Whoops! Oh! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, let's get up. I was gonna say, this one was a fun duel from... Oh boy, oh boy, get up, get up, get up. Nice. Okay, I was gonna say, this one was a fun duel from uh, Mario Party, the top 100 story mode. Oh boy. How do you even get up there without getting hit by that barrel? Oh, we're so close to the top. Let's go. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, you can bounce over the barrels. Ah, okay. Well, and also you get some invincibility after getting hit by a barrel. But yeah, we had a nice win there. And yeah, my video where we played through the story mode of this game was a super fun video. All right, Vine Country, another one that is from Mario Party 7, which I haven't played yet. Okay, so you mash A to climb and you go left and right to dodge. So let's see, you don't want to get hit by the spiders or the bee combs. Or wait, I guess they're called honeycombs. Whoa, whoa. So many of these guys. Is that the end there? Is that the end? Oh my goodness, we made it up without getting hit by anything. DK was even nowhere near to be seen. And here is the last mini game that is in Mario Party the Top 100, but not in Mario Party Superstars. It is the final battle over here. So Bowser and Bowser Jr. are running away over here. And we've got to get over there. This is the first thing we have to do, because this is a kind of long mini game. We have to jump from platform to platform and chase after Bowser Jr. And we want to not lose too many hearts. Ideally, you'd lose zero hearts, but let's see. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Oh, well, I guess they're not hearts. I guess they're more like pink circles instead of hearts. Okay. Now then we got to solve this puzzle over here. This is quite the tricky puzzle to solve over here. So let's go. Let's go. We want to ground pound these tiles. Let's go like this Then bring this one over. Okay. Now let's bring this one up. And can we continue up now? Oh, no, 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 I have to bring this over. I didn't realize this one was in the wrong spot. Okay, and there we go. The puzzle is complete. Now we can continue up here. Bowser Jr. looked so defeated right there. Now it's Bowser. It's not Bowser Jr. anymore. It's now Bowser. Okay, let's go, let's go. I'm ready. Let's go, let's go, let's go now. Jump over this, jump over here, jump over here, jump over that, jump over this. Pretty good, no damage yet, but that might change. We might start taking damage soon. And now there's a puzzle that is slightly more tricky than before. Okay, but the puzzle's actually uh, almost complete. It's not very difficult, actually. It's actually a... Uh... Whoa, 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 whoa. I was about to say it's quite easy, but... Bowser's attacks 
look more dangerous here. Okay, so let's go like this, and one more to go. And come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice! Okay, I like how the boomerang disappeared right before it hit me because we finished the puzzle. I wanted to try to jump over the boomerang, but it actually disappeared. Okay, and now the final showdown. Mario versus Bowser. What we want to do is ground pound these switches. And when you ground pound these switches, whoops. Wait, how did that count as a hit on me? How did that count as a second hit on me? What's going on here? This Bowser is definitely not playing fair. Hey, Bowser, come here. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. I'm going like this. And get in there. And come on. There we go. The lightning zapped him. Very nice. Okay, so he did take some damage. Let's go like this. Let's get him over here. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. Come here. There we go. Now come in here. Yes, stay in my triangle. Stay there. No, he got out of my triangle. So he actually didn't get zapped there. Okay, now he's going to start throwing his boomerang. Okay, nice job with your boomerang, bro. Okay, good job with the boomerang, bro. Now then come over here. He pushed me into the lava. Okay, go, 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 go. Just stop it. Stop hitting me. Stop it. Just get hit by the lightning. Come on. There we go. Okay, that time he got hit. He has three HP left. I also have three HP left. This is quite the intense battle over here. Let's go like this. Now hopefully he'll come here. Oh my goodness, I got hit by his boomerang. I tried to jump over it, but I got hit by it. This is getting close. We both have two HP left. Very intense battle over here. Now hit this. Now please, please let that get him. Please let that get him. Please get him. Good, we got him. Now we just need one more hit on him, but we only have two HP left, so this is a little scary. This is quite scary, but this should get him, I hope. Let's go. Come on, he's definitely got to be in there. He's got to be in there. Hello, Bowser, and goodbye. Bowser has been defeated. Mario is the winner of the final battle. I really recommend my playthrough of Mario Party DS. It is another fantastic Mario Party game that makes amazing use of the touch screen in minigames with some really cool boards also. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you watching. I hope you have an amazing day ahead of you and take care everybody.